Yeah, uh, very, very good performance. Uh, kept the ball well. Created lots of attacking chances. We wanted to do the 3 0 a little bit early to, uh, to take the sting out of the game, the danger of them scoring. Uh, it, it took a bit for us. The second half wasn't as good as the first half, but uh, I think overall, in general, uh, a good win and a, and a good performance. Well, I think um, uh, Dembele should be okay. Uh, he felt a lot of pain when uh, when he was brought down, but uh, he's steady now and he, he looks okay. Yunus as well, he felt uh, muscle tightness. Uh, we decided to take him off the, the pitch when we scored the third one, but he was uh, struggling, but he didn't uh, rupture anything. Uh, Danny Rose is the one that we have to be a little bit more careful with. Not very serious, hopefully not. But we have to give uh, one night uh, sleep to see his reaction and, uh, and tomorrow make the, um, the exams on the ankle. Are you hopeful that that be all good fit for, for Sunday? Okay. Yeah, probably Danny is the one that uh, is more in doubt, but sh at the moment should be okay. Um, he's, not, uh, he's not very, very serious, which is good. Did you say Danny was ankle, did you say? Yeah. And what about Eunice? Uh, he was between uh, his adductor. Uh, he felt a little bit uh, tight uh, in general. I mean, he's, uh, whenever we have the opportunity to use these games for him to be fit, we use it. And uh, you know, for a player who was, was out for so much, much time, uh, it's been difficult for him, but uh, to cope with the load. But uh, he, will, he, will, he would have been able to continue at the results uh, stayed at two 0 So we just removed him out of uh, precaution. Impression of the team compared to what you expected? I was surprised by the starting 11, which was uh, strong apart from uh, Anderson uh, and the injuries to Norby. Um, I think uh, you know their, their position in the league is, uh, is something that uh, worries them, but they came out very, very strong. Uh, very, very organized, compact. That's why we couldn't find the, the, the spaces so well in the second half. They never lost their organization. Um, and uh, you know uh, they can be a threat in, in the counter. Uh, oh, today we were uh, good controlling uh, their counter attacks and uh, and got the win that we deserved. But um, you know they have this difficult game uh, away now, uh, which can probably decide their future in the league. And I wish them well. Yep. Yeah, with the nil-nil, is obviously helps them. Um, they receive uh, FC Sheriff, we go to Wanji. Uh, if they get uh, something out of that game, puts them in a good position uh, straight away. Um, we, if we win in, uh, in uh, Russia, we could uh, be in an uh, excellent position with four more games to qualify. So uh, we'll focus on the win and try to get something out of that game. Yeah, at the at the moment we are playing with uh, one striker up front and and the number ten. We've been we've, we've scored 15 goals in seven games, uh, conceded one, which is good numbers for us. Um, we haven't seen yet a reason to to change the system to 4-4-2, although it will be definitely an option uh, in the future. Uh, JD is doing extremely well whenever he has these opportunities. So uh, I would say you know the, both players are competing. They know that they are competing. Uh, all of their performances have been excellent. Uh, there is uh, not one single negative thing that I, c that I can say about uh, the performances of, uh, of all of both uh, Soldado and Defoe. Okay. So, um, you know, I have to make a, um, a choice. Uh, yeah. But, uh, you know, it's when opportunities like this that arise and a player is able to perform that uh, puts the coach in a, in a more difficult position. Yeah, but uh, you know every player competes for a position. There's nothing new in uh, in football. Andre, 